Headsman! Where do you want me? You! Bring the prisoner! Yes, no more than she deserves for getting into bed with an outlaw. <laughs> Wish she'd get into mine. <laughs> Lord Kupka commands your presence. You're to bear witness to the girl's execution. Such a waste. <laughs> <laughs> Gav! Shh! Crystal fetters are a bastard to open, just so you know. Don't worry, I'll have them off before you can blink. Where's Jill? In the courtyard. Shit. We have to hurry. The Imperials have sounded the retreat and cleared out of the castle. But the place is still swarming with Kuka's men. Leave them to me. I'll make my way up top and circle round the back. Quick as you like, eh? Ah. Nearly forgot. Hold on, Jill. I'm coming. Where did Torgo go? Like, he told us to go somewhere, like, he understood where he gotta go. Courtyard. Like, where the fuck that so many people are fucking jack and fucking huge? Like, the headsman. You know, all these potions, damn it. Holy crap. I damn so bright. Don't you let her die. Oh, where it all began, our old home. God damn it. Fuck. I hope you've got a plan, Clive, because we are fucked if you don't. Entertainment. Enough! Yes. Perhaps it is time we served the main repast. I trust you are hungry! Need this? Much obliged. Stay close. We're getting out of here. And Togul, thank you. I wish I could have questioned what the fuck I just said. What the fuck your dog just did? Later, with me. <laughs> this is it ether? You, I mean, maybe that's why Togo wasn't affected by the ether. He was already into some kind of little monster. Motherfucker. What the fuck just happened? Oh, what the fuck is this 
cool shit. You guys ether too? Is everybody using ethers now? Right, they're gonna take care of everybody. Well, most of the area. Right? Somehow has fucking ether. Oh, well, it looks like it. Bitch. How can I do that same shit too? happened to Torgo? He just like juiced up. He changed. It must have been all that ether he must have inhaled in when we went to the fucking crystals. I've been wondering why he has to turn or anything like the other fucking bastards. Holy shit. It's over. For now. But I bet that wasn't the last of them. And they won't stop hunting us until Kubka's dead. So you get in there and finish the job, eh? Go on. 
If they come again, we'll hold them back. All right. But be careful. I haven't used this. Yeah, there we go. There we go. I want to know what happened. Clive Fable's uh, friend is freely protective of him and his allies. When Jill came to close death in the courtyard of a Rosalith castle, something awoke within him. Transforming Torgo into something akin to an icon. What? Wait, what the fuck? To an icon? I thought it was going to be something more like an ether creature. What the fuck? He must be some kind of new icon. Holy crap. That is completely new for me. And for the rest, too. I promise you, Sid. You'll die by my hand. Any more stuff? Any more stuff before I entered? It sounds like I'm gonna fight this bastard. Um, it is gonna be a fucking uh, the icon battle. Uh, yeah, there's some stuff. There's some stuff. Shit. There we go. Just enjoying your entertainment. How gratifying. Have you come to defend your father's throne, Lord Rosfield? <laughs> the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. A realm without a ruler, an army, even a people. A veritable kingdom of dust. Truly, I see no throne to defend. No! Enough of your games, Kupka. Just tell me what you want. Sid's head in a box. Imagine my disappointment when I learned that he met his end at the hand of another. And my relief to learn that you had taken up his thrice damned name. Your master slew Benedicta Harmon and defiled her body. If you choose to bear that murderer's name, then you shall answer for his crimes. The only crimes I shall answer for are my own. Sid did everything in his power to save that woman, though she was long past saving. And so I did what he couldn't. It was me all along, Hugo. It was... you. You... you killed her. I did. And I am fortunate indeed. I had thought the most I could wish for was to take the life of one he loved, just as he did to me. But it seems I was wrong. And I shall have my revenge. Shared a dream. I would be the king of the world. She would be my queen. And together, we would rule like the gods we are. But you crushed that dream. Well 
That's like a two combo there. Yeah.
The world has chosen. I am in my element. That's no escape. Okay, me. Fuck. Oh, shit. Is this fucking tremors? What the fuck is this shit? Holy shit! Oh 
tomó su mumu, es que la lleve. Goddamn bastard. Oh, I get the earth shard. I could make a weapon out of you, you fucking piece of shit. Uh, 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 uh,
You mustn't get yourself worked up. Wait! Another time, Mythos. Is that all of them? I think so. Well, Luda scum. Who the fuck invited them? Not that that's the biggest surprise we've had to do. Where did you learn to do that toggle? Not telling, eh? Suit yourself. Gav, we have to find Clive. Right, sorry. <sighs> You missed one. We were worried. So was I. I was so close. If it hadn't been for my gift, I would have finished him. I'm just glad you got out of there alive. When did the Royalists arrive? Right after you went inside. Just when we thought we were shot of Titans, lot. In pile Odins. Not enough of them to worry us, though. No. You didn't see the one who took Kukra away. So, what? You think they came here to save him? I'll be fucked if I know what's going on, but every minute we spend racking our brains, that bastard's getting further away. So what do we do? We go back to the hideaway. I'm too tired to think. As are you, by the looks of it. And after what Jill's been through. Let's worry about Kuka later, shall we? Aye. All right. Well, give us a chance to solve the riddle of your magic mud, too. Hey, how are you feeling? Ready to go home? 